can hear me. Yes, this is Ann Wilson. We have one viewer. So we'll get this is our very first time to do our pledge. So everyone, if yes, Akira Racho Yodge, thank you so much. And everyone, thank you so much for coming in. We are just going to let everybody uh, come through and practice what we have in there because this is our very first time. So let's see how this works to everybody. All right. Let's see if I can find any more stuff in there. Yes, guys, while waiting, you can please like and subscribe to our channel let me see where is my yes that would be the alumni of rizal ni m panugaling marie ayan dabon aya clarice and while waiting for our speakers again make sure that you have your uh, materials with you okay all right we can show that please like and subscribe to our YouTube and Facebook pages. Let's see which would be the, well, there's no that. It's just alumni of Rizal Youth Leaders. Okay. Kumusta, kumusta, kumusta? You can also say something from in the chat room where you're from. What grade are you in? We are live, alumni of Rizal Youth Leaders. Okay. All right. While waiting, we have more than 200 registrants, and hopefully they can find their way here. Um, that's one thing we just realized, that next time we are going to make sure that the live stream um, links would be in there, but if you are already part of our team, which is our ARYLI, then it would be easier for you to find all the things that's happening to our page. Yes, we have Kirsten Dyselin Coolio, Hershey Pina, Shannon Codeliero, Justin May. Napakahaba ng pangalan, Shan Codeliero, Justin May G. Formentera. Hi, I'm from the Philippines, Maria Lourdes Lupez Umpad. Hello, hello. Please share our live streams. And if you know somebody that are part of our, our activity tonight and they don't know how to get here, please, please, please share. All right. Maria Nina Anyora, grade 7, St. Charles Tisa National High School from Cebu City. Welcome, welcome, welcome. All right, we're going to wait for a few more minutes, okay? And um, we are going to take that out. We're going to stop our share screen. And again, everyone, if you could possibly... What is that? Can we see it? Can we see it? I'm not sure what it is. I need to see it. Uh, not yet. It's not working. All right. Again, make sure you have all your materials. I hope you saw that video for our materials that would be needed for our webinar tonight. Tomo Sorry, this morning or today. <laughs> all right. Kumusta, kumusta? Yeah, and they are slowly, slowly coming in through. So thank you very much. All right, let's put that. How come I could not put that in? I do not understand why not. Ay, ay, ay. See, we're having some technical issues here, but we are going to pull through this. All right. I'm trying to share this screen, you guys, but it's not working. Maybe I'll just minimize that. That might work. It's not going to work. All right, it's not working. Yeah. Okay, I'll find another way to make it work. And our speaker is just, our lect how do we call it? Our lecturer, our speaker is just waiting for everybody to hop in. We have 24 watching right now. Thank you for your like. You can like the stream right now, but you could also make sure follow and like our 
Facebook page as well as our YouTube page. Ayan. Good day. Watching from Cebu City. Marken Pantajo from the Philippines. Good day. And to all our teachers and parents that registered our students here. Thank you very much. Daghang salamat. Maraming salamat. Hello. I'm from Cebu City from Jeng. Mary Beth Louise O. Livlia, 12 System STEM student. Don Vicente Rama Memorial National High School. Well, Welcome, welcome, welcome. All right, again, please make sure that you type in your name in the comment section and be ready with your materials. All right. Okay, watching from Talisa City, Marilyn. Uh, good morning, Sir Joy is here from the Philippines. Thank you for coming from the Philippines. Fantasianel, Pauline Iris Hortelano, Bronx, New York. Ang hina ng signal, pasensya na po, wala tayong magagawa dyan. But I hope it would be better, no? At least na ata sa Facebook. If we are in Facebook, we have a good chance of having a better signal than watching it in YouTube. But you, if you are also in YouTube, you can just go ahead and watch us from there. Uh, Kira, belated viva to everybody from Cebu. Viva Pitsinior! Viva! Viva! <laughs> Jensen Marie Galinero from, oh, from New York. All right. So we will be talking in multi-languages in here. We will, of course, we are Filipino. We know how to speak English and Tagalog. It's a bonus if you speak Bisaya because I am Bisaya. So mugawas na siya sa akong baba. Hinahinay nga magbisaya sometimes, no? From Cebu City, Mom. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Watching from Cebu City, Marlene Banaay, Sibumpan from Don Vicente Rama Memorial Elementary School. All right. So before we start off with that, I will be reading the procedure and how we go through this. Okay, everybody. All right. So let me see. So we have here, if your mom or friend of your mom brought you here or asked you to come here, I am just going to read to you the invitations that we sent them. So here we go while waiting for everybody to come in. So far we have 34 students. Oh my gosh, this is so small. Okay, how are we going to do this? Let's maximize that one. Would that work? No. Okay, so the this organization, ARYLI, that um, we are part of in college, um, launched a project this year called the Rizal Pledge Series 2021. These pledges or personal life education for growth and empowerment are live short webinars that we will be airing through the alumni of the Rizal Youth Leadership Institute Facebook page, and also in our YouTube page. We would like to invite you and your students who are even just your students with your encouragement and support. So this is the invitation that we sent you as our way of saying thank you and helping us reach out the youth. We have some fun stuff for you, teachers and students. So these are the things that we have in store for you. So if you are the teachers or yeah, the teachers who will be able to make 100 for more students to register, attend a live pledge, we will automatically be entered into a surprise raffle. So um, I don't think we reach our 100, but maybe we can take a look at who has the most number of students here. So teachers, if you are watching this um, replay or in a little bit, or you are here live watching right now, so you have a chance of winning in our surprise raffle. Teachers who will be attending the live pledge will also be receiving a certificate of mentorship. And um, now for the students, students who will register, attend the live pledge and submit their work in the comment section will get an international certificate of appreciation. Number two, students who will register and attend, like and share during the live pledge will be automatically entered into the surprise raffle. Now, the top three students who students with the best outputs will be given a certificate of recognition. Work must be originally done by the participant and must be submitted in the comment section 15 minutes after the pledge session has ended. Integrity of the output must be preserved. Winners will be invited to virtual short demo interview and awarding that will be next week also because we will have our launching 
and we will be inviting those three winners to show off their um, to show off their um, outputs. Did I miss anything? All right, maybe we'll wait for another three more minutes and we will start. Whoever is in here, that would be it. I am trying to share the whole entire um, invitation, but um, it is not working. So um, let me see, stop share. So just to make it simple and easy for everybody, we are doing this through Facebook Live because we understand the situation of the signal one and i know if you have an unlimited load in the philippines you can watch facebook but it's hard for you to do um youtube or other forms of that but if you have unlimited internet that's way way better however we just need you to be present for the whole entire webinar and how do we know that you are here is that we will check your work the output and we will only give you the end time for example we finish at 11 o'clock until 15 minutes of that so we will say whoever submitted their work from the time we ended until 15 minutes those are the participants so it's easy all you have to do when we're done with our session is to take a picture of whatever you finished with and then put it in the comment section on this live stream mismo okay and then make sure you have your name your full name in there so we can check it with our registrants so again guys please try to understand that we are giving out an international certificate Okay, so our, our presenter today is from New York, teaching in New York, residing in New Jersey, and she has a qualification to send out certificates also for, for an international certificate. So again, oh, nag, may nag-raise ng hand, klase tayo today. Ayan, so I see those who are trying to put in their names, you are here, we are checking your attendance, we see that but we are only giving out the participation certificate or certificate of participations, participation to those who will submit their work. 15 minutes, okay? Any question, <laughs> now my question, right? if you have any question, type it down on our comment section. Again, if you are here, make sure you already wrote your name, wrote your name in the paper. <laughs> All right, so one more minute and we will be introducing our speaker. We have we also have another another lead here in our alumni of Jose Rizal Institute and she will be introducing our speaker. Grace, if you are here, I'm going to put you on our stream. Welcome Grace Luna. Grace Luna is from the Philippines. Hold on guys, one second. I put Grace on the spot. That's why she left. <laughs> All right. So we have Grace in there. And um, I hope she will come back and she will be um, introducing our, our, our presenter for tonight. Okay. I don't have a music. I should have a music here, but we will be copyrighted. How do we submit the picture in the comment section? Okay, so in the comment section, you are going to put the picture. What did it, You can comment and put the section, put, put the picture. If that's going to be a problem, let me see. Do you, is that possible? I feel like that's possible. Oh, yeah, my question talaga. How do we submit the picture in the comments? So just like when you put, let me go to Facebook, ha? Huh? Okay. So when you go do a live stream in there and I'm going to comment. See, when you are, when you, can you see it right there? So if you have a comment in there, you have your emojis, you have your um, GIF, and you can also press that right there camera roll and then you pick your cam picture that you took earlier and then submit it in there or put it there and write your name 
okay but maybe i need to do a tutorial on that for you to submit it later okay so grace i already saw you earlier where are you don't leave me <laughs> there you go grace i'm gonna put you on spot you will be the you will be the one to introduce our presenter today i oh, know what thanks grace oh there you go hi grace good morning you are on mute <laughs> You are on mute. Unmute your mic. Grace, can you hear me? Hello? Hi, oh, there you go. Good All morning, right. Happy Anne. Hello from the Philippines. Hi to you out there in the different parts of the country. We are doing our first ever live stream on the pledge session on. Uh, Yes, hello, can you hear me too? Yes, I can hear myself feedbacking, but it's okay. Grace, can you do the honors of, in, of, of, honors of uh, presenting, introducing our speaker, uh, speaker, man, uh, presenter? lecturer for today i'm still adjusting quite a bit for the audio i'll be back in a few okay yes i can hear myself feedback all right so again while waiting we have 53 viewers for the meantime um we are asking everybody to please make sure that you um, subscribe and like our YouTube and Facebook pages, Alumni of Rizal Youth Leaders. That would be a backup. This would be uploaded in YouTube. And um, if you can, you can message us in Facebook, you can message us in YouTube if you have any concerns, okay? So again, this is our very first time. We are just making sure that technically we're doing it correctly. And if not, we apologize. We're trying our very best to make sure we can accommodate everything, okay? So while waiting, we are going to give a shout out. Bray, Bray is here, miss. Bray is here. So <laughs> we are going to contact Bray. And Bray, you will be you will be our next speaker. We <laughs> that degrees our speaker. Akira oh. uh, Racho, you can use Mike from this YouTube channel. It's copyright free. Oh, okay. Next time we are going to put a background for our... So that's something we are going to make sure that we can do the next time. Aliza Ditan Mabulu, Cebu City. Talisa, Cebu City. Oh, Seth Abria, Seth is here. Yes, thank you. And again, you have to post your output right away in our comment section. And we are going to close it in 15 minutes. Only those who will submit their work within the 15 minute time frame will be given the certificate of participation. And we will pick three that would show their work. Um, on our launching next week, all right? And we will have surprise giveaways also in a little bit. This is his daughter typing. Okay, good morning from Cebu City, Marifel Pasaol. And if you have not liked and subscribed our channels yet, please do so. Good morning, Patrick Didi Gito from Cebu City. Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you. Can you use music? April Villarreal from Cebu City. There you go. Oh, John Philip K. Tubalado, Cebu City. Ha, make sure na anamoy ko anha materials. Please make sure you have your materials. So when it, we are ready to start, mag start na dayin tawa sa way pag dugay dugay. <laughs> Good morning again. Congrats, Mary Grace, to Luna, my kababayan. I'm so proud of you. There you go from Irene F. 10 Chavez. Here you go. We have 52 right now, so we understand those who register, might they might not know where to go. So that's something we have to make sure next time that we are going to put the link. Just make sure you are subscribed to our channel. We are, make sure you follow our Facebook page 
kasi nandoon lahat ang mga information. Doon kami nag-a-update. Ayan. Adrian Bilbao, grade 12, UHUMSSVPSSG officer in DVRMNH watching live from Cebu City. Kadaghan sa acronym. Napay HUMSSVPSSG DVRMNHS. Da, nahurot ang acronym sa kalibutan. But welcome, Bungalan Adrian Bilbao. Alright. I hope you're ready, you know, on Saturday morning in the Philippines. Ayan. I hope you're ready. I think we're having concerns with Grace, so I am just gonna introduce our speaker so we can start. Filipino time, bayat, ano? <laughs> so we should start on time. Filipino time is... We are starting on time, right? Sakto, sakto. Okay, we have 52 watching our stream. I hope you can make sure. Maurugin na akong ibalik-balik. You need to like our page so you will be updated with a lot of activities. We have a lot of activities coming up. And um, yeah. Good morning, Georgina S. Gabuya from Maghawai, Talisa, Cebu City. There you go. There you go. All right. Okay. We will start in a couple of minutes. Maybe one, maybe two minutes. Okay. All right, so I'm just going to start na lang. Sige. Grace, we are having technical issues with Grace, so we are just going to remove Grace right now. Okay. All right, shout out to everyone that's here. For 51 of you who are here, we are ready. So officially, good morning, everyone. Maayong buntag, magandang... Mabuhay, magandang araw. Good morning. <laughs> Pasensya na, bisaya, na, nalilimutan natin paano magtagalog. But thank you very much for coming in, for registering, for making sure that you are here and participating on our first ever pledge um, activity. This is Rizal Pledge, the personal life education for growth and empowerment. This is a series that we will be doing hopefully every weekend so we can impart to you what we know and hopefully that would help you um, in the near future in the future or even right away in in your life so what we will have right now is our session one an introduction to fashion sketching the first sketch practice set the face and the body and then we will have hopefully you will have your paper your sketch pad your pencil your eraser and your colored pens and markers so our resource speaker or our presenter for tonight for tonight for today is um 80 actually she she was my professor when i was in college in Cebu normal university She's my mentor back then when we have our Rizal activities back then when I was in college. She is now, um, has been the founder of ARYLI, um, alumni of Rizal Youth Liter Leadership Institute, and a now New York teacher or an educator here in, of course, New York. <laughs> And he and she went to um, FIT New York for fashion and sketching. Ladies and gentlemen, students, teachers, whoever's watching, please help me welcome Miss Olive Abarquez. Let's give it or give her a hand. Ayan. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I am now gonna Miss. Can we hear you? Yes. Can you there hear you me? Go. Yes. Okay, thanks to our wonderful host, of course, no other than the amazing Anne Marie Wilson. <laughs> Did I even introduce to myself? Our host. Thank you. Yes, thank you. Yes, yeah, you're welcome. And this would not be possible without Anne Marie. So, Anne Marie is our powerhouse at the alumni of the Rizal Youth Leadership Institute. The same with Ramwan. Ramwan cannot join us today, but they are. Uh, the reason why we're able to put this up. So there's one thing about um, trying to plan something for the youth, but executing it is 
even more challenging. And thanks to Anne Marie and her skills, by the way, she did not learn that in college. Okay. <laughs> she didn't learn it. And that's why she's going to give you guys a training also. And if you're watching right now, we are going to invite you later on. And I know you're uh, at that nakaya tamang so good, no? Pero I just want you to understand that we are here, the Luna of the Rizal Youth Leadership Institute is here for you, the youth, okay? We want you to understand there are so many skills that true you can find in YouTube, true you can find, you can learn from your mom. But with us, guys, we give you the certificate to really uh, show a proof that you have a training. And that's why we are here. We have created Pledge, the Personal Life Education Growth and Development. This is your pledge. This is your personal life education growth and development. And we're providing that opportunity for you. Today, I'm going to be teaching the first session, the first pledge session and that is the introduction to fashion sketching and we'll be just be focusing on head and body actually you're we're gonna end up drawing also the the clothes so i um i just want to share with you uh since you're very young uh when i was in third grade pag grade three na ko ganahan juta ko mag fine arts ganahan ko mag fashion designer but fact Okay, so Pilipinas and the Philippines, it's really hard to pursue fashion design. If if that's what you want to do, there are several schools now in the Philippines. I guess there are two in Cebu and you can do it. But one thing that I can tell you this is what happened to me is that I ended up becoming a teacher, which I really wanted to do. And then when I was a red ed teacher, I went to the Fashion Institute of Technology to make sure that my sketching skills remain intact. So I want you to know fashion sketching was my first love when I was a kid. We had no TV. We didn't play. I didn't play video games. I sketched. And I'm sharing that today with you. And we're going to start simple. So some of you guys might be very good in sketching. Good job. Keep it up. Okay. To Try avoid to avoid technology. technology. And oh, wait, we're gonna have an echo. We're gonna we're gonna use that later. Okay, sorry about that, guys. Uh, so I want you to use this as your personal life education sketch when you have time. And then my this is how we're gonna go with our fashion sketching this evening. And at my type technical difficulty, so kanang hulat hulat ha pasensya na. So we will start with um uh getting used to you know drawing lines that's really going to be quick like one minute then after that i'm going to show you how to draw a face there are many ways to draw a face but i'm going to show you one way then we're going to have to take a break because we will have a raffle to say thank you to your teachers who have helped you come here and we will also have a raffle for you students after that one we're going to draw the body we'll put a dress and then we're going to end the session Okay, so if you have any questions, I'm not very sure if I could answer it, but um, I, I am looking at your questions right now. Okay, so uh, I have not figured this out too, but Anne and I will now try to show my sketch pad. Okay, Anne? So guys, if you hear an echo, pasensya na ha. <laughs> I'll try not to talk so much when um, we are doing it. We'll be asking Anne Marie now to um, show our paper. Hello, Tito. Thank you for inviting your students. Ha, salamat kayo. Everybody, hi, hi, Rose. Oh, hello, Tita. Yes, my dear. Hello, Ate. Welcome, welcome. Don't forget to write your name in the comment section. Okay. So we're all right. Yeah. Technical technical difficulties. Make okay. sure. You, well, I can see that it is working on my end, but it's just okay. black it's just on, the on the screen. There you go. Uh, no, I there. think that's the one. Yeah, it's working. Should I? Would you be able to mute my camera? No. What about you mute the ones you have right now in your okay. in your in your laptop? All right. I'm gonna do that. Okay, okay, guys, you don't learn this in college, huh? You're just going to learn this from Anne-Marie. <laughs> <laughs> yes, they do. Okay, so let's begin uh -oh, with still um, echoing lines, okay? And I see my yes, paper, no that's echoing. my sketch pad. That's my pencil. Do you see it, guys? 
And oh, don't forget that. your eraser. There you go. Okay. okay. All right. So, so I have a are... trail, patrol eraser that shows I'm a mom, no? Remove. Okay. Kaning mama ta. Nice kayo ang atong kuan. Mga gamit sa balay. Okay. So remember that lines can be thin. Okay. You can draw a very thin line. I hope that you can see that. And then you can thicken your line also. Okay. So this is very important in sketching. For those who have been sketching already, we know that this is um, very important. Okay. And then there are lines that are crooked lines, what we call as crooked lines. Okay. And there are round lines. Okay. As an artist, you will eventually know what kind of artist you are. I'm more of a, I guess it goes with my personality too. I like round lines, okay? Sharp lines are a little bit too much for me. But nevertheless, as an artist, you don't, you don't avoid any kind of lines. You try to uh, learn all the lines. And then when we are drawing lines, we can also add shapes in our lines, okay? So as you can see, there's rectangle in our lines. So if you really want to pursue fashion sketching, uh, sketching, like, you know, just practicing your lines is really going to be a lot of help, okay? And I want us to review also our shapes, okay? It's hard to make a perfect circle. So we just, you know, call that a circle, okay? Now we also know as artists, a circle is different from an oval, okay? An oval is an elongated circle. A lot of people think that faces are round, okay? Well, I have a round face, but if you really examine it closely, faces can be a combination of a beginning of a square okay and then you uh, turn it to like that okay so um if you are a math major i know you know what shape this is uh definitely that can be a beginning of a face okay that's my timer for myself so i just want to review tonight i have taught you that lines can be thin it can be thick when you're sketching, it can be sharp. I have two sharp lines here. It can be rounded. And you can incorporate shapes in your lines, okay? And then um, we're going to be using a lot of circles, ovals, then combination of um, shapes, okay? So now that I'm done with that, I'm going to flip over my sketch pad and go to a new page now if you have only prepared one bond paper you can always go flip to the other side i'm just gonna do that to you because um just like many of you guys i'm a fan of um preserving nature and you know paper come from trees and i really want to support uh preserving our nature by cutting on the use of paper so at the back of your practice lines, let's go now to doing the face. So I'm going to time myself for uh, three, uh, four minutes for the first one, okay? So when drawing a face, there are so many ways to draw a face. I'd like you to know that um, I learned how to draw this face when I was in high school. And it, it stuck with me that it has been so difficult for me to, to really, you know, get away from drawing it if, if drawing has, or sketching has to come naturally. So why did I tell you that? I'm telling you that because you are right. There are many ways to draw a face. Okay, what I'm going to do right now is just going to show you a one one way of drawing a face. So I uh, usually start with a forehead. Everybody, can you do that? Okay. Forehead. Is that a forehead? Of course, it's a line. <laughs> okay. Now, the forehead can turn into a cheek. So very slightly do this. Okay, so from a thick to a thin, 
slightly like that and if you are not happy when you make double it's okay to draw it's okay to erase you might not want to erase okay i'm gonna give you 30 seconds to look at that okay and then now that we are on the chin side uh this is a very delicate matter a lot of people don't like you know round chin unfortunately over time i did have develop a round chin and that's perfectly fine okay then you make this this rounded a uh, slightly rounded corner okay do you see that gonna give you 30 seconds all right now that you have that slightly um rounded corner we're gonna stretch it a bit okay now instead of going up here don't do that don't do it here that's too thin i'm gonna erase that okay and then look look just bring it to your right okay bring it to your right that way okay all right um honestly this is a very narrow chin you, we could actually make that better but um for now let's just keep it like that i'm gonna give um those who just came in a few minutes to no few seconds i love putting it in seconds this is what i do in my classroom too so you know so if you came in lately i'm gonna count one to five i'm gonna go over the sketch again okay So if you just came in, uh, we have already started drawing the face. We start with the forehead. Then you go a little bit of a concave. Draw the chin, uh, draw the cheeks. You can make the cheeks really pronounced. You can do that too. And then now to the lip, uh, mouth area, and then to the chin. Honestly, this lady has very narrow chin. So I'm going to delete again or erase because women women actually don't have very narrow chins okay well asians do so just move it to the right okay and now um we have like a face do you get it Okay, I know I wish we could talk, right? I wish you can give me feedback, but it's okay. I trust you guys that you're doing this right now. Okay, so we have already drawn the face and it just looks like, you know, set of lines. But now this is what we're going to do. We're going to put the eyebrow. So um, I do make my eyebrow and I still draw them. I mean, I could have done something else, but in all honesty, it has become a habit and it's really hard to let go. And drawing the eyebrows, it's like, I feel like I'm sketching on a daily basis. And um, this is how we do it on a paper, not on the face. Okay. Kung sanao, au siempre, kung praktisado na ka, you do it by. And that's easy. And I want you to know eyebrows are very important, especially for the girls. And men has to understand. Um, brows actually divide, define the face, okay? More before, I mean, now we have contouring and all with makeup, but it's really the brows. So brows are very important, even in our drawing, okay? So we're going to start here. I want you to find a point, okay? I mean, even I'm, I'm even drawing a dot. I will eventually take that out, okay? And find here like a bridge that you will eventually you know that's gonna be look do you see the point okay oh okay i'm still gonna continue okay so try to connect okay at first it's gonna be really thin okay now i did not reach my point but that's okay and that's the beauty about um, putting dots in your sketches, uh, it gives you a chance to uh, really decide uh, how you want it later on. And the beauty of sketching is that we can always uh, erase and improve. Okay, so everybody just here. Can you please do that? Okay. 
Okay, now I can also change her eyebrows, change it that way. Okay, I want you to know that this morning my students had art class and I really love the teacher. His name is Mr. Tony. I just love him. Um, I do like to do what he teaches us and um, or, I mean the students and I feel like I'm a student too whenever he's in our class. Uh, what I like about him is he doesn't erase. So when we're sketching, he doesn't erase. Actually, to be honest with you, our teachers at FIT do not also promote erasing anything from the sketch. But I guess I have not reached that level in fashion sketching where I don't um, erase. So it's okay to erase. It's okay not to erase. Okay. Now we have the brow and then we have the notes. Okay. Uh, noses can be drawn differently, but I'll just leave it like that, if that's okay with you guys. Okay, and I understand there's a delay, so I'm going to take a 30-second pause. A five-second pause. Okay. All right, we have the nose now. I'm going to put the timer on again. Oh. And then, then you see you you draw a tear tear no teardrop luha ba, okay. Okay, I'm gonna bring down um the camera. Can you see it? All right, perfect. Colbert, kakita ka dong, makita ni mo dong. Okay, so makita sa mga estudyante ha. Okay. And then we do the on the other side brow. Okay. So how do you like to do it? You do the brow. I will not tell you now to do it your way. This is how we just do it. Okay. Uh, the left brow of our face will be more pronounced because, of course, if you understand, our model is, um, you know, in a particular angle like like this one. Okay. Now, the eyes, there are many ways to draw the eyes. I'm going to, um, <laughs> thank you, uh, Fanta Chanel, <laughs> classmates at college. Salamat. Okay, magtabi rin yata, ha? Um, it's hard to draw the chin. Yes, my dear, it's hard to draw the chin. So take your time, ya. Ayaw ka balaka, ha? I-erase lang kung dili ni mo, dili ka satisfied sa chin. Okay. Okay, anyway, look, ang ako ganing chin, narrow ka, yun na siya. Okay, pwede man na, na to i-move, no? Ana, okay. Okay, it's hard. The chin is hard. I agree with you, Jeng. Pero ayaw ka bala ka kay, mga kuan ba yata, mga newbie man yata, ang ituduan ka ron. I promise you guys, the more you practice, okay, the better you become, okay? And, and... When you draw the chin, try to start from anywhere. You can start from the ear down here. You can start from the chin up there. And it's okay. Okay. I think that looks fine. Now we're going to draw the eyes. Okay. Uh, like I said, there are many ways to draw the eyes, but I'm going to uh, teach you a very quick one because we have already spent eight minutes right here. Just draw this. Can everybody try to draw this? Okay. Draw that. Yes, our model will be closing her eyes. Yeah. And then look, look. Draw your draw the rest of the eyelids in an angle like this. Okay? Uh, I'll bring it down. Okay? Like this, like this. Okay? Everybody, can we do that? I know there is a delay. So I'm going to count 10 seconds in my head. All right. Now, here, do this. Okay, or we can make it thinner, guys. Let me just correct myself. Because she's closing. That's a very thick eyelid. I mean, it's okay. Okay, because this one has to look like that so i think i overstretch my line all right okay let's do this part again 
huh? If my teachers were watching me now, they're going to be, what are you doing? But it's okay. I'm teaching little students. I love to teach this, you know. Um, I've already taught fashion sketching at PS 173. Um, I did it uh, one time with them. And it was really fun. Uh, one springtime. All right, now let's add the lashes, okay? Uh, there's a saying amongst women that true, eyebrows are life, but lashes are lifer, okay? To me, um, my whole thing about makeup, guys, if you're very young, you don't truly need it. Okay, but when you're older, it, it becomes a way of communicating that you actually take care of yourself. Okay, and just like our model right now, I think our model's face now is now all shaped. And I hope you liked it. I hope you like your work. If you don't want me to make a comment on the face that you have drawn, please take a picture of that later on. Post it in the comment section. And I will make comment on it. Okay, I'll try to get to it. And if I'm not able to, just watch out for me here in Pledge in our personal life, education, growth, and development. And definitely, um, there will be a follow up to this. Except that I just want you to know there's so many other um, teachers who will be teaching you. So it will not be so soon. Practice this phase. Now, of course, what do you think is missing? Okay. So our model has closed eyes. We need the lips, okay? Start with this. Start with that, okay? Five second delay. And then I will, I will go, I'll finish the lips, okay? Because it's really hard to, when you're sketching, it's hard to stop midway. So, you already went up your little hill, go down the hill. It's not a very deep valley. Go up and stretch the lips, okay? And then now that you're there, go back to the beginning of your hill. Now go in, go in a little bit, okay? Go back out, make it round, okay? Round is, uh, so our model here is a plump, lower, lower um, lip, okay? And then all the way round it, round it, round it. One, two, three, here we go. And connect. All right, there you go. Our model looks so pretty. Okay, um, you can fill it in, okay? Uh, or you can put a line, it's all up to you. It was a straight line right there. And I'm gonna finish now. The drawing of the face is really challenging at the beginning, but then once you have that, we, again, like I said, I will review. You start with the face, the chin, the chin, round it up with the jaw. Then the bra, look, I've left it like that. Make it thicker, guys. Uh, it's all up to you. I can also change the bra to look like this. And remember, our model is um, angled in a certain way that you will not see the full bra. Okay, so you can make a sharp line here. Remember, I told you about sharp lines. Okay, and then here, make it thicker, like the way I draw my bra. <laughs> I do it, you know. Um, I know a lot of people like say, oh, they notice me drawing my bro. Okay, I know you guys watching me, but at the same time, I'm really doing it for myself. It's really like, you know, I'm doing my first love. I like to really sketch in my face too. And then the nose, then you draw the teardrop right here. You put your eyes, the eye starts like that. Uh, we have not finished our eyes but it's okay then you draw the tender um thin um lashes you can also okay darken your lines now and then make the lashes it's not very curly that's okay um 
Then now we, and then we had the lips. And then I'm going to stop for like five counts. Okay, delay is over. We can put an earring if you like. Like I said, I really like round things, but you can also change that to a hoop. If you like a hoop, draw a big, big circle. Or don't forget, we also draw diamonds. Okay? So if you know your shapes, you know how to draw your diamond. And if you want, you can do repeating lines. Um, today in the art class for my students, uh, the art teacher reminded them about radial lines. So you can put something in the middle and then it goes repeatedly around. Okay. So now we will draw the hair. Okay. The hair um, can be anything. If you want to throw, um, you can do that. Uh, what's very common is just look. Hair is very simple. You just draw that, okay? Like, ooh, you're drawing across the face of your model. Draw another one, okay? Draw another one. So here, you don't really draw the hair. You just draw the lines. And then here, don't forget the other side symmetry of your earring, okay? The radial design of your earring. And then look at the hair, okay? Just like that, okay? Now, I will have to draw back the camera. And this will be your hair. Make it thick. And that's your model right there, okay? Do you see our model now? Can you guys see it? All right. Okay. So, um... Hello, Irene. You can't perfectly sketch. Uh, I, you know, that's what they're saying. The first times are always hard, but we actually get better. So did you see the hair? I know my hair is very thin. I'm going to thicken it now. Okay. It's not really, um, Irene, it's not really hard. I understand how you feel. Um, this is our first time. Like I said, I have been doing this since I was in third grade. I learned this face um, when I was in high school. If any of my high school classmates, batchmates are watching right now, they know that I was already sketching then. Okay. And some of them actually asked me to sketch uh, their uh, dress for our fashion show. So we are done with the face. Hey, good job, you guys. If you have something in there that looks like a face, I think you're doing a good job. Now, for some of you, you might want to take a picture, post it in the comment section. We're going to be entering you guys in a raffle. So I'm going to call in Anne-Marie right now. Anne-Marie, uh, we are going to, I'm going to give everybody to take, uh, we're going to take a five minute break. I'm going to put my timer on and we will have a raffle. Thank you, Anne. And you're muted. <laughs> oh my goodness, with technical issues. So if you are in our Facebook and YouTube pages, give an emoji clap for Miss Olive. That was amazing. I would not know how to do it. I could not follow along because I am cutting your names, guys, because after five minutes of your break, we will be giving some raffle prices to those who are here. I know we have 250, more than 250 registrants, but only 67 are here in Facebook and four in YouTube. So we shall see if your name are here, if your names are here. Thank you for the claps. So five minute break, you can use the bathroom, get some snacks, get some water, and then come back right away. Ramwen is already here. Ramwen, you can join us in a StreamYard, Ram. It's an hour group chat. All right, give it a five minute break, you guys. I'm on my last cutting. Ramwen, sunod padak ana tong Excel. Don't get an ahu gag mic. Ning ning kung kadiot ta ha kadiot ra kayo. Miss, what are we giving away? Ah, uh, so we're still gonna be giving out the 100 load, and you know how many? Sell it to you. How many? How so many? we're gonna have. 
We're going to have three um, teachers. Uh-huh. And then maybe a parent. We do not know, uh, no. no. Did they no, say they were whoever, mom? No, whoever recommended the names in there because we only ask who, where did they hear it from. So next time, okay. we can make sure we include that in our name. So how many yeah. for students and how many for parents or whoever told them to register? Okay, so we're going to have three for the teachers, three for the students, and then uh, two for the parents. No, we could not. <laughs> no, whoever, whoever recommended them. So for the students, okay. we will be giving out 100 pesos um, Gcash. So if you are here, you have a chance to win 100 pesos Gcash. Three winners, but you need to be here. Kailangan na amo din here. But for the parents, we are just going to inform them um, through their phone numbers or their emails because they might not be live because their parents are or their kids are using their channel so we are gonna draw after five minutes we are gonna draw three winners for our students and after we draw the body or sketch the body that's when we will draw for our parents or whoever okay. recommended okay mm -hmm. all right let me see if i can pull up my um my timer here break time session all right are we gonna be on a break time too? <laughs> yes, you can you can go ahead. Countdown timer. Okay. Mark. All right. Yes, All right. you need to save your you need to save your um voice. Okay. Let's do the generic timer. Why would you do that to me? All right. No. Oh, well, I'm so afraid to color the lips, but it's okay. Yeah, I'm ready for the timer. That's <laughs> timer, the manual timer. Ay, sige, sige. Okay, four minutes na lang, four minutes and 50 seconds. Yeah. Okay, there we go, guys. I'll be working on the sketch also. Uh, no, okay. There you go. There you go. I got it. Alrighty. Okay. Mm -hmm. Where? Si ako na lang mo kanta yun. Kinsa kiri na po hindi mo play the music in other copyright? Ma copyrighted. Tapos we can play some non copyrighted stuff in a little bit. So. Um, you know what? I mean, that gives time. me an idea. Next time, guys, I will prepare the songs of Johnson so so that we can actually play it. Okay, now it's sharing right. the stream yard. We have that timer. Yes. Oh, you're okay. All righty. Okay, no, it's okay. I'll turn this off. Okay, the manual timer. That's fine. I'll turn it off now.
Okay, I know there are questions about how to submit that work. So like we have mentioned already, uh, you can take a picture of your sketch. Picture na siya, unya, i-attach ni mo sa imong comment. Okay? And marie Yes, time is up, everyone. So thank you again for all the teachers, parents that um, helped us spread the good news. And um, just a heads up, ha, next time when we give you registrations, whoever <laughs> recommended you for the page, make sure you write the name, not just my teacher. We would not know who your teacher is or from the college, from group chat. Put the name so next time we have a raffle draw, they will be, um, their names will be here. So, so far we have 70. Don't worry if you are late, you can review the live. I guess, Miss, we are going to extend until 30 minutes because our yes, yes. live stream right now is um, uh -huh. a bit slow. We have a lot of interruptions. So, after Perfect. this one ends, we are going to tell you until what time you can submit your work. Yes, okay. how to sketch from. We are doing it, Charina Chate or Clarina Randa. Yes, he he ko kabalo mo sketch. So that's what we are here for. We are starting with just part one, session one. Right now, we are going to do our raffle draw. Three winners of 100 peso G cash. So you need to be here. Huh? 250 more than 250 registrants so if i call out your name and then you're not here we are gonna count maybe 10 because taas na kayo kung one minute mahurot na tong time if wala mo dire okay you have to put in your um okay all right i'll show you later how you can put on your comment and picture in the comment huh all right our first winner all right, our first winner is the Kukabasa. Kay Gamay Kispanan Magkwala. Okay, Ubas Merchon. Naa si Ubas Merchon. All right, we'll give them a countdown 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. Ubas Merchon. Yes, Merchon. 3, 2, one. Wala si Ubas Merchon. We are gonna move on. Okay. Tulura kabok winner ha. 100 peso low. Ay, 100 peso Gcash. Okay. And we are gonna contact you because we have your information. Ah, okay. Naa sa inbox ni mo, Miss Ananda. Okay. Let's see. Naa si Reyes Georgina. Reyes Georgina. If you are here, say something in the chat box. Say, I'm here. Present. Ayan. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Hala, we posted the sketch on the FB page sa ARYK. <laughs> in the comment section. Yes, Dili I saw that. Uh, no, uh, wait one second. Dili na siya ma-post sa comment section karon because it is not posted yet. This is live. Yeah. So once ma-post uh -huh. ang live, dito pa ninyo ma-post ang comment. Okay? We are gonna try that in a little bit. Okay? Hala. Ram, you can send that to me if you wanted it that way. But let's try the first strategy first. If it doesn't work, then we can ask them to redo it in the other one. Okay? Bi wala na. Oi, wa naman ni si Kuan. Asa naman ni si Reyes, Georgina. Hala. Oi, ugma patama human. All right. We'll try more names. And if they are not here, then oh well. Next name is. Hala. Eureka Marie. Para Gele. Eureka Marie, are you here? Eureka Marie, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Wala si Eureka Marie, absent. Oi, noon sa. Kung sa Marie, kung ato na lang ng tanawo, no? Ang naa sa itong live karon niya, sila na lang ang ato ang padawon. Next year, baka makakita sa 71 ka buo. Kasi masuwat na ng mga pangalan. Taas na kayo na. Naa sa Carpal, Regina Reyes. Oh, I'm here! Oh, okay, one winner. Yay! Congratulations! 
uh, Gelly, I'm going to make sure your name will be put on a side. Eureka Marie. Congratulations, Eureka. Maayo. Ako ni Butang gito na safe spot para di mawagtang si Eureka, ha? Ako si Chang ni Butang sa itong listahan. Okay, lista na si Eureka. At least we have one. Saya gada ogunta si IC teacher. Oh, make make sure again if you register unya ibutang ang name sa teacher. Ibutang din ang name sa teacher para para makuha na to ang name. Ha, all right, two more. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. All right, let's see. Perry Louis Viquizo. Na asip Perry Louis absent si Louis Dino. Louis Dino absent. Louis, Louis, Vic, Perry, Louis, Viquezo. All right, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Congratulations, but what's it All right, next. All right, one more. Siguro oye kense naman ni Ukma patamahuman. Next time, next time. Mudaghan na ni sila. Okay. Okay, next would be Avon Ray Galado. Ivon, A I V O N E. So, I Ivon Ray Galado. Na si Ivon Ray. All right, five. Oh, ten. This is my teacher din ha na nakaila ani. What na absent imo si Janty, ma'am. Ten. Alam na this, ma'am. Seven, six. Five, four, three, two, one. Congrats from Fiona. Ah, sige, sige, sige. Wala, wala. We will pick one more, ha? That's it. Okay, mga absent. Ugma pa tama ko. Dili, pwede ikaw na lay daog, sir. Oy? Na akay chance later. So, to those teachers, no? To those teachers nga nag-effort yun nag-send sa mga GC and to other pages, thank you very much. If your students really registered and there are 40, 50 of them, you have 50 chances of winning, no? All right, next. Sheila May Diano. Bro, kita ako aning Sheila May Diano ganiha. Sheila May, na aka? Angel Luna is here. Hi, Angel. Hi, your, Angel. I saw your picture. You picture in kasi mong mama while you're doing your work. All wow. right. Ten, nine, eight. Oi, by the way, mag hashtag siguro tag A R Y L I miss. Pledge? Yes, I think so. Sige, Anna. Okay. If, if, you have Anna. Pictures, if you have pictures nga nagsuwat or nagdraw mo or nagsketch, hashtag A-R-Y-L-I. Ibutang inig-post ninyo, ha? Ibutang ninyo ang hashtag A-R-Y kay mag-post with ni sila, no? Especially makadaog. And so, I really is telling us na mixed category na daw students and um teachers na daw. I guess it's okay. We just uh -huh. want to move to Anna lang. Yeah, pledge. Okay. Okay, yes. I pledge. No, because um, later, um, teachers miss, we are just going to draw their names right away, even if they're not here, because they might not be here. So right now, yeah. the students really need to be here for them to win. So we are going to move on. We only have one winner, but we are going to try to call two more later, okay? And three yes. more for teachers. Is that good? Again, if yeah. you are sharing, um, if you have pictures, mag Filipino ba yata, no? Mag Wait, first of all, Gina. And where is Georgina? Georgina has to say something. Georgina, Mom Olive, Abarcas, ni comment na. Oh, sige si Georgina Reyes. Sige, with the, Georgina is here. Oh, okay, Georgina. Okay, Reyes. Uh, okay. Smile. Okay, kung nasa may mga post. Sige, dali. Reyes. Yeah. Okay. We're gonna be asking um our fellow A R Y L I Tabangi si An Tabangi oh, na right now. If you have a picture in a selfie selfie mo diha while you're steps uh, sketching, put in your picture and maybe you will put in hashtag. Once again, when hashtag, hashtag so A R Y L I. I love it. Thank so you, Charina, for the hashtag. A R Y L I pledge one. But tangan siguro na to one ram so we can see who's doing one, two, three. No, A R Y L I pledge one. Thank you, Ramwen. Okay, so every time you post in there, we can also see your and behind the scenes. A R Y L I pledge one. 
Oh, a good job. All right, we are ready. Again, okay. get ready. Stretch out. Pareha kung mag online class ta. Stretch up in the side, on the side. Stretch back down. Ana. Or okay. we are ready. Okay. All right. Yeah. So, okay. We are ready. Mm -hmm. We are now sketching the body. Sakto ba, miss? Uh -huh. <laughs> yes, that's correct. Okay. okay. So I'm going to put myself on mute and I'm going to hide. Take it away, Miss Olive. Okay. Once again, I would like to thank Anne Marie, our wonderful and amazing host, for, you know, making this live FB streaming successful for our first personal life education, growth, and development. Thank you, guys. Some of you are messaging me in the private messages. I promise to get back to you. But one thing that really stood out in one of the messages that I'm getting tonight is somebody took a picture of their work. And I'm like, oh my God, the kid is 11 years old and the sketch is amazing. And for those who are doubting themselves right now, don't, okay? Sketching does not just happen right away. So if there's something that you're passionate about, nurture your passion. Keep doing it. I was a terrible um, sketcher. <laughs> now I was terrible at sketching when I was in third grade. But then somebody who's in third grade just messaged me and I'm a fourth grade or fifth grade. And I'm really impressed. Thank you so much for sending your work. Um, I believe in you. You can do so much better. Now we're about to embark on a much challenging part of our introduction to fashion sketching. Our bodies are not going to be the same, okay? And I will tell you this. Whether our bodies literally or bodies in our sketches, they're not going to look alike. I want you to know artists have signature bodies, okay? I have been to FIT and I have seen how it doesn't matter. The teacher was teaching one way and we all ended up interpreting the body in different ways, okay? So we're going to move on to that. But before that, I would like to let you know, you can color your sketches, okay? Um, I try not to because... When we don't color our sketches, it's really organic, okay? You can choose to highlight the earrings. I saw someone with a very nice uh, drawing of the earrings. You can just highlight that one. You can just color the earrings or you can color the lips or you can make uh, do an eye makeup for your, for your face. It's all up to you guys. However, keeping it like, you know, like not really colored is very raw and it really looks beautiful okay that's what sketching is all about okay so we're gonna move on now i'm gonna get another piece of paper okay and now you can see that and of course um uh, i will not do a practice anymore we're here live for one hour and 14 minutes already we promise you 45 minutes i guess that's not possible so maybe uh, we're going to go now to just drawing, okay? Now, remember when I taught you about the face? Usually, the face goes first, okay? I'm going to count five seconds for the lag. Okay. So, let's do now the face, okay? We're going to go back to... Because maybe I really like this. Okay. We're going to go back to drawing the face. Okay. I will do this. Okay. Na stress on my strack. I listen to my tudlo sa lawas noon. Yeah, we are not in person. But um, I'll try to do my best, guys. I know my lighting is not a perfect. Um, I used to have a table where there's a light from underneath. I don't know where that is right now. It must be in the storage. But again, just draw the face. You know how to draw the face already. Shin and draw. Okay, like that. It's not as good as the beginning, but don't worry about it because now we're focusing on the body. Draw your bro. Brow, the eye. Kilai, your nose, brow on the other side. Since this is tilted in a different angle, do that. Draw the eyes. So, boys and girls, <laughs> students, we are now going faster with our drawing. 
put the eye, put the eye, put the lashes. Okay. All right. Do you have it? And then you put the mouse. Okay. Okay, there you go. So when I see that it's not very proportional, sometimes I leave it alone. But tonight, because you guys are watching, I just want to tell you that you can always edit it. And like as usual, the chin is is hard. You can't the chin can be too far. Okay. So let's work on that. I'll be quiet working on the chin and the jaw. Okay, put back the lips. Okay. Okay, for those who have been sketching, I guess this is really easy for you. For the new ones, don't worry. Uh, it doesn't really have to be that perfect. It's okay. Everybody, we always start at different points, just like in life. So use whatever you have right now. So you can, um, you know, finish this whole task and really see how far you can go. Then we put the neck. Okay, do you see the neck? It's just one slanting line. Now do the other side. It should be a shorter line. Okay, now we draw the shoulder. The shoulder, just draw a slanting line to the left. Okay? Did you do that now? Okay. And then cur put a curve at the end. Okay. A rounded curve. Okay. You can tell we're already about to draw the elbow. I mean the arm, upper arm. Three, two, one. Let's go. Wait. I'm seeing myself on... The phone, I'm still drawing the the shoulder. Okay. Okay, let's do it here on the other side. Now make this a little bit longer, please. Because our um model is tilted in a particular angle. Okay. All right. Now that this is longer, draw the other shoulder shorter. Okay, should be shorter than the left shoulder. Round it. Okay, there you go. Do you have that already? When we are drawing the body, we don't really put the hair yet. The hair would be depending on the dress that our model is going to wear. Okay, so now we're gonna leave it like that and then think of an hourglass. Okay, hourglass should be right here. Hourglass coming up right there. Okay, guys, we have to have a little bit rounded um, area right here for the breasts or the chest. Do that, please. Okay, so now we are done with the chest, going down to a narrower hit, uh, waistline. Okay, that definitely is not my body at all. <laughs> okay, thicken your line. Okay, and then of course, depending on what you are going to draw, what type of dress, we're going to do an A-line dress tonight or this morning, okay? 
So right now we're going to do an A-line dress coming up. Of course, if it's a letter A, you already have your right there from the waist. Okay. A, just spread it out. Okay. Then on the other side, spread. That's your first, first, um, how do you call that? Uh, rest of the body. So you are not really draw drawing the legs right now. Uh, we are actually now proceeding to the body with a dress. Okay. Uh, I will not be able to really show you uh, what we say, uh, what we call as a cro croquette. We call that as croquette. You can actually print the croquette online. Okay. Uh, what I'm going to be giving you as a body right now is a body of our model. Now, of course, we want to make our skirt, not a regular skirt, but a ball gown. So remember when I said to you about uh, rounded lines? This is where uh, my signature as a sketch or someone who does fashion sketching will go in because I really do like, okay, uh, rounded shapes okay and she's wearing a ball gown here we can do the jagged line remember i told you about the jagged lines guys this is already a design to the dress so if you already have a background in drawing dresses feel free not to do that don't do that i'd like you to come up with your something of your own just make sure that um our model is actually wearing something okay all right. Hello, Jang. I'm sure because maybe we're under pressure or under time pressure right now. That's why it's really hard. But I'm sure you are very good in doing um, a portrait. And a portrait is definitely, uh, uh, how do you call that? It's a uh, level up in sketching. Okay. Fashion sketching is really more like let's do the face and the body quick so we can get to the dress. Okay. So I know I promised you body. But you get a body with a dress, okay? I don't want our model tonight to go naked. And since I want to do a Filipiniana, watch what I'm going to do with the shoulder, okay? So for Filipiniana, you want to go like that. Draw this. All right? You can already see where we are going with this. And then you see the shoulder here on the side? Draw that, okay. So guys, I'm gonna give it like a 30 second for you guys to figure that out, or a 10 second count. All right, so let's continue. Here we go. Just continue with that. Okay, and that, here you go. And of course, we can always go back to our work, erase it. You may also want to leave it. Okay, then let's go to the other side. This is a, bit, a little bit longer. Okay, just close it like this okay and then here all right and see i did not erase that i'm going to turn that into a design okay to show that this is a filipiniana dress okay and then we're gonna put the arm of course the arm was right here then like that round the elbow do it like this to the other side and she's hiding her hand behind her and then her elbows is just straight right here okay so okay now we're gonna put the hair oh wait we're gonna do this part okay so i'm thinking that uh this is going to be a shawl filipiniana you can do watch this i'm gonna try uh two ways to do it okay 
So you can just draw something like that. That's fine. But of course, it's not that fancy looking. I want to take that off. Okay. You can also decide to go really plunge. So you have a very sexy uh, revealing Filipiniana right there. You can do that. And if you think about it, that's the shape of an inverted triangle. See, knowing your shapes, um, I've known shapes in sketches, um, not as math, you know, figures. You can do that. And then you can have it. Okay. Or what I really wanted to do, because Filipiana, Filipiana is kind of conservative, I want to do a combination of conservative and something that's really revealing. Okay. <laughs> Guys, I know some of you might be commenting right now. I wanted a body. Now I have to design a dress. Well, um, like I said already, if you want a croquette, um, you can print it online and then put the clothes on your croquette. Uh, it's like really a shape of the hips. Um, uh, waist, hips, and legs, but I just decided tonight, um, let's just put clothes because <laughs> um, you just want to put clothes. You already know why, <laughs> okay? So my design would be uh, for the Filipiniana. This is going to be stretched out here, and like I told you, I like, okay, round shapes. I'm going to do the same on the other side. Round shapes. Of course, it's going to look different. But of course, that's a little bit too conservative. I don't truly really want my model to be like that. So I'm going to turn this whole piece right here as a body. Okay. So it's going to be, uh, wait, okay, this way, like that, like an inverted triangle again. Connect it there with a design pattern like that. I guess you have seen this in swimsuits, right? Uh, maybe I'm not doing it correctly here, but um, one thing about sketching is really being able to execute what you really want to happen to the dress. I guess that's just what I can do for tonight. Uh, I hope it doesn't bother you or bother anybody. I can color it. Okay. I need to curve this a little bit because you need to pretend that there are like, this is the chest area and the chest area is kind of curved. Okay. And then here you go. All right, curved. Okay. Uh, retrace your work. Okay. There you go. All right. So, um, I will be ending my session in two minutes. I'm going to be working on the hair right now, and then we can add a little bit of detail. So let's do the hair. Filipiniana would be conservative here, so we might want to do that with bangs. Okay. And right there. Did you see what I did? So just round it up. Okay, and put it over here. Now, if you want to put some jewelry and you want it to stand out, uh, do really sharp lines. Okay, ever wonder why a king or a queen's crown has to be sharp? That's a reason. Because if it's smooth, um, it wouldn't you wouldn't see it at all. Okay. All right. And then you can shade, 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 shade. And be careful when you shade because you still want it to look like natural hair. Okay. And we're done with that. You can put the jewelry. I like to put little beads in here. You can just 
you know, combination of straight and circles. Um, rendering your sketch is another skill. It's actually not advanced, but a regular fashion sketch uh, skill. But we're not going to have that. I guess what we're trying to achieve tonight, we have already achieved. We have drawn a face and we are done with the body. We perfectly see, uh, we see a, you know, a lady here wearing our national costume. Do we even call that national costume now? Okay. And this one, you can be, put beads, you know, just random circles. Okay. Right there. And, you know, you can put more in your skirt. Uh, I guess that ends my session now. Uh, here you go with our face, the body, and our um, model right there. Okay? So, Anne? Let's give it a hand to Miss Olive again, everyone. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Miss Olive, thank you so much for sharing your not so Welcome. Known, not so Hi. known talent. You know, I I've known you for wait up, 15, 16 20. years, 20 years. I don't even know that you can years. share that well. Oh my gosh, I need to learn uh -huh. from you. Anyways, I am so happy. I'm checking in YouTube right now. I see other others that are doing behind the scenes while they're doing it. They're taking pictures. They're putting hashtag ARYLI pledge one. And I have actually, I'm so proud of my cousins right now. I have two of them working and they said it's their first time sketching the face and I've seen their work and I'm so happy and they are so happy. I know. Doing it. And I've seen um, Angel doing it. I know some of us. And I also want to extend my my um, thanks to our fellow um, alumni that are sh that shared our our invitations to our teachers, their friends, and their families, and that extended you know our invitation to our students. Oh, go ahead. You can have your little break, Miss Olive. So I will be calling in Grace also. Grace is here to tell us something ahead. But before that, guys, you need to unmute yourself, Grace. Make sure you like our pages because this is just the beginning. Simula, una pa lang po ito. Marami po kaming naka-in-store sa inyo na pwede po nating ano, matutunan while doing online. No, Not just Facebook. This time, it's not just you know looking at pictures of our friends. It's not just looking at trending videos and all that. We can also use Facebook to learn something new and apply it in our lives. Diba? Give me a thumbs up. Kung agree kayo sa sinasin. Tagalog, lagi mag-listen. <laughs> Very good ang Tagalog. At oh yan. my goodness. Alright. Grace has something Hello. to say and then we're gonna raffle one more name for the student and three names for the teacher. So don't, stay put muna so you could be here for one more name. All right. Yes, Thank you so much, Ate Anne and Miss Olive. I miss the two of you. Now, people might be asking, um, what are you? Why are you doing such things as uh, fashion sketching, etc.? And how does it relate to your organization, the A R Y I? Alumni of Rizal Youth Leadership Institute. Does Rizal do fashion sketching also? That might be a question. But I believe um, what we're trying to to tell everybody here is that. Uh, the organization that we are in does not just um, go out and uh, tell the public who Rizal is, but it's more of that. We are into uh, getting into the skills that we can also do as the youth of the day that can help others also unleash the talent within them. So this is just but one of the many that are still coming our way. Sooner or later, we will still be posting a lot of updates Atiana will give us uh, some of her talents later on and the other skills also. I know Ramban is behind the scene. He's just but shy to show his face. Uh, Ramban, I hope you are hearing this one. I hope you can join us on screen too. Later, mm -hmm. we will be also hearing from you. I hope that. I'll be thinking of a topic that I can share with everybody in this uh, forum. So let's watch out for that. 
I'll get I'll give back to you the floor at the end. Okay, thank you, Grace. Do you have the presentation for next week though? Next week we will be launching our ARYLI awarding. So keep keep posted guys make sure you have your <laughs> have mine here too so don't worry say hi we have kids we are yeah, we have kids maybe maybe i'll talk a little bit towards that so for all of you who are watching guys they're actually the alumni of the Rizal Youth Leadership Institute has been awarding students already so if you are a student leader you're doing well in school you can be our candidate you can be an applicant to the young Rizal emulators award and you're we're gonna inform your teachers about it so teachers if you're watching right now rest assured you're gonna hear from us we're gonna look for your best students in your schools and we the alumni of the Rizal youth leadership institute will send you the medals but we give you teachers and principals the full discretion to choose who deserves the the medal okay so next we are we have this pledge and the big 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 project that we have actually is called the international Rizal Award. Rizal stands for Rizal International Award for um, Zeal of Achievement in Leadership. It's the biggest award yet. Even the Knights of Rizal have not given international awards yet. We, the alumni, are the first one to do it. And I want you to know the Knights of Rizal is like our mentor organization, and they are existing because they are um, under Republic ra6 republic act 646 so guys we're legit okay we exist here for you and we're here for the youth the knights of rizal exist for everyone in the philippines all the filipinos around the world we exist for all the youth okay who want to develop their themselves and follow what rizal has always um espoused about the youth we are the hope of our motherland fatherland we are the hope of our country and we're gonna give you these skills because we are in our 40s 30s now we are near the exit we're not in the exit yet and we want you to come over okay we want you to step up and before you guys step up we're gonna give you the skills so please watch out for our launching of the Rizal award it's an international international award for youth organizations our young Rizal emulators award is for individuals so we're giving a lot of recognition to the youth because you know what we believe in you we love you we know you're gonna take over our spots in the future to make our country a better place to live in all right hey. thank you so much miss olive so just to summarize that one next week we will be live again on a weekend so the day would be a saturday morning or afternoon miss we don't have the time yet so we are gonna post the time for our live that would be the time next week when we inform you everything so basically we will award individual students and group of community leaders that are doing something with their community or community groups or teams or something like that you will have more information next week again yes. please do like our page so you will be more updated also ramwen is just telling us there are two ways to post your um outputs today okay so you First, you need to be a registrant. Pasensya na kung hindi po kayo naka-register kahit nanood po kayo ngayon, hindi po ko namin kayo bibigyan ng certificate. There is also a time frame where you have you should supposed to have registered. Pero kung wala, at least you have learned kung hindi kayo naka-register, there will still be a lot of upcoming upcoming um pledges. So, just a just a, a um um unshameful unshameful plug next not next week but after that one so two weeks from now i will be teaching with um youtube 101 so i don't know if you know i have youtube pages i know some students right now kids right now are very interested with youtube so might as well learn something from it and maybe in time you can monetize your youtube pages meaning earn from it meaning get money from it you know so that would be my next topic i will be um the presenter of that one 
But for now, make sure naka-like. So, sorry. Once this live stream natin ngayon, ma-post na, pwede na ninyo doon malagay ang inyong mga pictures. Parang comment ba mismo sa live. You can do that. But if you think na hindi namin makikita yan, pwede din yun din i-message sa amin po ang inyong output. We will be very happy. We'll be very proud. And again, we will pick three more winners na mabibigyan not just the certificate of participation, but the... Unsa ganito yung name sa certificate? Miss? Certificate of recognition for the top three work. There you go. So the best three work na pipiliin namin at i-a-announce namin yan next week sa aming launching. So, very, make sure that you watch out. Make sure naka-like po kayo at meron po kaming YouTube page. The same thing lang din. Pasensya na pag nagtatagalog, nahihirapan talaga. So, eto na. One more winner for our... Whoa! Miss, you would not believe this. We have a celebrity in the house! <laughs> <laughs> Baka celebrity ka. <laughs> John Dave Duenas, Hi. how are you? I'm all good, I'm all good. I, I was just like listening to you guys and I was watching Miss O's um, uh, right. sketching, how would I say this, masterpiece. Yeah. Hi, John Dave. Hi. <laughs> One second. Hi. John Dave, do you want to say something as to your topic yes. also? Yeah, I think we have to let um, everyone know that John Dave is the CEO. Um, he's a startup CEO. So he used to be my former student. So all of you students are watching out there. This is why we are here for you. We believe you guys are going to be someone in the future. Look at John Dave. He used to be just my student. And now he's a startup CEO of Hybrid. And he will actually be talking tonight, Saturday evening in the Philippines. Parents, teachers. If you're watching this, you want to watch John Dave talk about uh, healthcare. So, John Dave, go ahead, do your plug in. Hi. So, um, well, I am more than excited uh, to be joined by you guys. Um, I think it's more than, how do I say this? A decade, Miss O, since the last time that we have seen each other before. I visited Wait, I just saw you here in New York, so don't say yeah. that. <laughs> like weeks ago, if I may say. And then that that uh, ski thing that we we tried to explore also. And it was so bad that you were not able to join us. Um, I'm stuck here right now in my hotel in Manila for the 14-day quarantine because it's a standard ruling when you get back from the travel-restricted countries. Well, um, for that, I guess it's more of um, I'm going to grab the opportunity to share something about healthcare, about uh, digital healthcare to be exact. I just came back also from a face-to-face -face session with Harvard Business School. So I was there for a couple of days, if I may say. And then um, we're more starting about, uh, we're, we're, we're into right now looking at how the reformation and the revolution of, of things in healthcare. So we basically, more of Unsa man ni magbisaya? Okay, mo sabi ako mo bisaya. Ano mo siyempre English? I just I just want our viewers to understand why is it that you guys are talking about healthcare in the middle of your sketching? Uh, I want you to know, students, this is your future. John Dave is gonna change your future. Okay, and parents who are watching, you wanna know about this because. Um, personally, I talked to him while we were in a ski resort and I told him, is the Philippines ready? Is the Philippines ready to collect and store personal information of anyone who gets sick? And he's going to explain that to you. Are you agreeable? I, I don't know if we have a say on this, but that's where the Philippines is going. So students, if we're watching right now, you want to invite your parents when he will be live tonight here in our Facebook um, page. He's going to talk about healthcare system. And you bet, I'm going to grill him on some questions. So, <laughs> yeah. okay. so there's a lot of things going on, guys. So ayaw taong magkalibog. In Tagalog, wag po kayong mag... So after this session, right now, we will end this in a few minutes. Thank you, John Dave. Our no next topic will be John John Dave 
John Duenas right now about healthcare, it would be on our Facebook page live. So again, make sure naka like and subscribe and follow kayo para it will just pop up in your screen. These are free information, guys, na, you know, you would not just learn it anywhere else, but you can learn it from us. And it's for free. <laughs> yeah, this is an insider's info. Right. And then next week, we will have the launching of our um, awards, awards for Rizal. And then the next week after that, we will have a series of more pledges from me, from Grace, from Ramwen, and the other members of ARYLI. Yeah, right. and in between the the pledge series, we have talked. So parents, uh, we will have something for you to just continue to like and uh, turn on your notifications for our YouTube and Facebook page. Thank you so much. Thank you. I promise this will be a good five minutes and we should be done. One more student. So kung nandyan pa kayo, you have a chance. One more student and then three parents or teachers and we're done. Promise. All right, let's see. We have, thank you for joining us again, John Dave. No problem. I'll see you guys later. See yes, you later. <laughs> Desiree Sandoval. Are you here, Desiree? Desiree Sandoval. All right. Five calling, for, calling for Desiree. There are 50 people viewing right now. About you. 10, 9, Nasa Desiree. 8, 7, Six fellow five, teachers, Vincent as Desiree, students, four, the Wagan as Desiree. Three, two, one, maybe not. Thank you again. Even if we had 250 registrants, we have maybe 40, 30, 40 percent attendance. So that's still okay. At least we have students. No, Muran Ashag Ako, Karan guys, 10 Kabuka Hosu Jan team, Wadtugu is had to teach one, <laughs> one live student. So that's 10%. So at least I'm there. I mean, I have to work and that's the reality of life. So mauna siya, ipadayon ang live stream, bahalag usara mo tanaw. Okay. Aljuni, did Aljuni Kihano. Aljuni, Aljun Ray. Ambot lang, Aljuni. Kihano. Kihano. I think this is a familiar last name. Kihano, are you here? I'm gonna pick one, and if they're not here, oh well, do her atong winners. Kana ba? <laughs> okay, because we gotta go, guys. It's very late here. Miss Olive is in New Jersey. I'm in Maryland. And yes, it's late here. Let's move on. Tabasa Marjon is the. Oh, na asi Aljunri? Miss Aljun? Wala man. Here, like it is Aljun, oi. Tagrani lagitag, but he was here earlier, maybe. Ni uli oh, na kay na. Three na lang ganihan. Abot mi tag 60 ka pin. Ni uli nag sayo, nag cutting class. Uy, <laughs> ayaw. No cutting class. Tabasa Marjon. Marjon Tabasa, where are you? Comment na yun. Ay, wala. O oh, sige, wala na. So now let's move on to our teachers and parents again. Next time, if we have the registration, guys, please write the full name. Ayo lang. Don't just write my teacher. We would not know who your teacher is. <laughs> or my my school. Oh, please tell us. Huh? Yeah. And I guess we have to make a special mention to Miss Uy. What's her name again? Um, she did Yelin. a very good job. Yes, she Yelin. might be one. Okay, if you have like, if you extended the invitation and if you have 40 students that, you know, registered, so you have a lot of chance of winning. So let's say, hopefully, makuha natin si Miss Uy because she has a lot of entries. I know. So, Special mention, Miss Uy. Salamat ka. Yeah, right Yelin, 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 yes, yeah, Yelin. Yelin. Uh -huh. So thank you again to all the teachers and parents, no? And for, if you have found us from Facebook also, Facebook Live or Facebook Promotions, thank you so much. So we will just pick three names here, Miss Olive, and then um, we are just going to inform them that they win because the teachers might not be watching us live, you know? But, yes. Right, thank you so much, Mom Mark. Ha, akong glasses, para na siya sa layo. So, ayaw mo kay Bong. Maria Oclanaria. Alright, that might be a mom or a teacher. Thank you so much. Um, next one would be, what's your name? Maria Oclanaria. Na siya? Na si Miss oh, Maria Oclanaria. Okay. Na ang teacher. Thank you kayo, ma'am. Oh, next is Thank Nasha. Thank you, ma'am. 
Next is Nadja Navasquez. Oh! Hala, uy, grabe, nakadaong po na siya sa akong YouTube. Congratulations oh. na, Nadja. Oh, supporter na siya ni mo, miss. Supporter na siya ni mo. Nadja na ba? She's your batchmate. And guess what? Oh, yes, I know Nadja. And guess uh -huh. what? We She's have another car. one. Let's give it a hand for our tech support specialist, Ramwen Lorenzo. Ah! Thank you. Yes! Hi, thank you, Ramwen, for joining us. Hashtag ARYLI pledge Ooh. one. Yes. Oh, I just wow. want to quickly say Ramwen is going to teach you guys how to do artwork online, digital art. Okay? Yes. Can be one of our right. teachers. Last so. one for the teacher, Mrs. Miriam Rotakio. Okay, Rota how do you spell Rotakio. that? R-O-T-A-Q-U-I-O. Rotakio. Kio, right? Mrs. Miriam Rutakio, congratulations. So again, guys, please, please join us next week. And we are going to pick the three winners or the three best artists at this time. No, it's intro. But maayo, kaayo, miss kita na yung gusto work sa uban. Hashtag A-R-Y-L-I pledge one. Thank you, everyone. Enjoy the rest of your night. So give me a high five. Estudyante lang kayong peg, no? Thank you so much. Give me a high five. Hello. Thank you so much for loving this organization and for the furry first pledge. Ayo sa mo pang lakaw? Post briefing or post to an. And then the rest of us, we can just say bye bye. Please like, follow, and subscribe our pages, Facebook and YouTube. Sigi mi balik balik ana. It's because pasayang lang. Dili man siya sayang, but then there are a lot of resources that we can offer you guys, and I hope you are gonna grab the chance. And the only way to know that is if you are following us. All right. Stay safe out there, everyone. Are you Bye, out? everybody. Bye. You? I'm going to end the broadcast, but I think we can still be here, guys. All right. Okay. End the broadcast. Thank okay. you. Bye. -bye.